All right, YouTube, this is Two Cent back with my Two Cents on Octopath Traveler. And let's talk about some of the things that are going to be coming up this week uh, based off the roadmap because we haven't heard anything coming from the Twitter account yet uh, clarifying exactly what is to come. But I think that's just because we haven't seen uh, our kind of notice on our maintenance. But taking a look also at the sheet, I'm not sure we're going to get a maintenance this week. Anyway, let's get into it. All right, so here's our roadmap that we've just been living off of since, uh, you know, before August here. And hopefully on the 21st when we have our new tavern talk, hopefully they present us with a new roadmap that kind of goes for another three months. Uh, I think this has been really nice to kind of prepare ourselves, uh, it, you know, at least for me, been really helpful just to kind of see the things that are coming to the game. Uh, I fully expect the next one we have, we're going to actually start seeing some different gameplay modes on it. I expect to get the Warrior Tower in the next three months. Uh, do I know that for sure? I don't. But I do think there are uh, moving content along with that. We've gotten a lot of the, you know, Warriors able to... Uh, make a decent team up to do that tower so i think we're going to see it here uh before too long now looking at this week uh you can kind of see up there at the, uh, at the top right this bestower of wealth chapter two looks to be like it's coming uh but you can kind of see that we're still within version 1.3.1 1. Uh, it doesn't seem like they're lining apart to where we're looking for another version. So I think that's why we haven't seen a maintenance notice. Uh, I don't look at any of the data mines. I don't know, even know how to do any of that. Uh, but I'm assuming that it's already in the uh, package that we already have in the game and that it's just going to become live. So that's one of the things that we should be getting this week. Um, with it being mid-November at this point, and if you're looking at that, uh, it, it's definitely on the earlier to the midpoint of November, so I don't think they're going to wait a whole nother week and then put it out, uh, uh, the update out then. So I, I, I do think we are going to get Bestower of Wealth Chapter 2 uh, this week. And also with that, we're there's only one other thing that's looking like it's going to be coming out, you know, aside from a character, which... Sadly, I do not know who that is. I will give you speculation uh, at the end of this video of who I think it's going to be, though. Uh, but the only other thing that we are, you know, what I would say for sure, 95% sure of what we're getting this week is the alpaca farm. Uh, and that is definitely just going to be one of those other things that you're going to do for your nameless town. Uh, it's going to provide just some more mats that you can go ahead and trade in uh, to get materials to, uh, to spend in the little shop there. Uh, so... I just like to keep up on these. It's not hard to keep up on them. They do give you stuff. Uh, this does kind of like add to your daily tasks for your nameless town. Uh, but I know there is a quality of life in the future that you can uh, pay like an errand boy to do your town errands that should be coming at some point in the future. So I know some of these things might be kind of coming along and being tedious, but go ahead and do all of them. That way later on, if you're too lazy to really want to keep up with them, at least they're already there and you can just pay an errand boy to get them done for you. Uh, but I do find that a lot of the things in the shop, like getting the, uh, uh, the gold guide stones and stuff like that are really nice to be able to pick up. Uh, and you can get some, you know, some tasty nuts and some other things in that shop as well. So it is good to just go ahead, pick up on this. It'll probably have some rubies of reward from the quest chain anyway. Uh, my guess is, you know, after the update, uh, you, you should be able to just pick up a quest probably in your nameless town. If it's any more complicated than that, I'll make some sort of note on it in a, in a future video. But I, I'm assuming it'll just be in your quest log and you'll be able to go and get it and get it done. Uh, so that's kind of what we have coming. Kind of be a, a short little video here because there isn't a whole lot. But I do have a speculation of a unit that's going to be coming out. And I really do think we are in the times... Of, of Cyrus. I, I, I can't give you guys any for sure on that. I just have this feeling by the time I even edit this video and post it, we might have a notice telling us who's going to be out and I could be wrong. Uh, so uh, if you're watching this video pre that, uh, go ahead and post down below who you think it is uh, going to be. And if it's post them announcing it, uh, tell me how wrong I was down below. That's fine. Uh, it's just, you know, fun little speculation. I just think we've kind of maneuvered through enough of the other units, the older units, that I think we are getting to that point where he, 
he definitely could be released at any time now. So anyway, that's been my two cents.